Hello, science enthusiasts and inquisitive minds. Welcome to another thrilling chapter of our channel, where we'll delve into a fascinating universe, Beekman's World. Beekman's World is a television series that left its mark in the 90s, capturing hearts with its unique approach to science. Beekman's World was inspired by the comic strip You Can with Beekman and Jax by cartoonist Jock Richard Church, who passed away in 2016. The series premiered in 1992 and quickly became a phenomenon, reaching children and adults with its amazing experiments and explanations of various natural phenomena. At the center of it all is the eccentric Beekman, portrayed by the talented Paul Zaloom. With his distinctive green attire and a mane that doesn't go unnoticed, Beekman captivated the audience with his passion for science and his unique ability to make complex concepts accessible and fun for everyone. Throughout the seasons, the show treats us to a variety of educational segments and hands-on experiments, all presented with a healthy dose of humor and irreverence. In addition to Beekman's charisma, the series features equally endearing characters like the rat Lester and the fearless assistants Josie, Liza, and Phoebe. Together, they form a dynamic team that turns learning into a true scientific adventure. In total, Beekman's World had 79 episodes between 1992 and 1997. If you're also a fan of Beekman's World or are about to embark on this journey for the first time, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, activate notifications, and share this video with other science enthusiasts. Let's see how Beekman and his assistants are doing today. Paul Zaloom, Beekman. Paul was born in 1951 in Brooklyn, New York. He is a renowned artist, actor, and writer. In addition to continuing to act in theater and television productions, he is also known for his work in solo stage shows, where he combines comedy and political commentary. Paul Zaloom retains the right to continue performing as Beekman in live shows for children and adults all over the world. Beekman made an appearance in a crossover with the popular YouTube show Captain Disillusion titled Beak Malusion in 2016. Mark Ritz, Lester the Rat. Mark was born in 1946 in Pennsylvania. He was an actor and director best known for his work on Beekman's World, appearing in all 79 episodes. He was also a puppeteer, so when he was hired for Beekman's World, he thought he would be operating a puppet named Lester the Rat. He was surprised to find out he would be wearing a rat suit. Mark Ritz passed away from cancer in 2009. Alana Ubach, Josie. Alana was born in 1975 in Downey, California. She appeared in 26 episodes between 1992 and 1993. After leaving Beekman, she continued to act, appearing in various movies and television shows. She is known for roles in films like Legally Blonde and Bombshell as well as for her appearances in popular series like Euphoria. Eliza Schneider, Liza. Elisa was born in 1978. She appeared in 28 episodes between 1993 and 1995. Elisa is a talented actress and voice actress. In addition to her work on Beekman's World, she is also known for her contributions to various video games like Assassin's Creed, and animated series like South Park, where she provided voices for various characters. Santa Moses, Phoebe. Santa Moses was born in 1973 in Illinois. She appeared in 25 episodes between 1993 and 1997. After the series, Santa Moses continued acting, with roles in various television and film productions. She is known for her roles in series like My So-Called Life, and the film Home Alone. Did you enjoy Beekman's scientific experiments? Comment on which episode was the most interesting for you. Do you think there should be more scientific series like Beekman's World? Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more amazing content, please consider subscribing to our channel. Don't forget to hit that like button and share this video with your friends and family. Your support means the world to us, and it helps us continue creating fantastic videos like this one. Thanks again, and see you next time.